Eastern New Mexico has endured so much. And now the city of Clovis is left recovering from Wednesday's storm. And as Julian Fadas reports, they have not experienced a storm this strong in years. 80 mile per hour wind, severe rain, and golf ball sized hail. These are a few of the conditions Clovis saw Wednesday. It was definitely a, a storm that uh, is not a normal for us. Justin Holwalt, the Clovis city manager, says it's been nearly a decade since they've seen something as damaging as this. Curry County emergency manager Dan Hearding says damages are being processed. Right now we're still doing the damage assessments here within the city of Clovis. Clovis got hit with some of the remnants of that storm. After Wednesday's storm, people in Clovis are seeing everything from overflowing waters in their local parks to damaged metal structures that have been torn from the storm, literally laying right outside their local schools. Storm chasers like Al Mason also feeling the pressure from the chaos Wednesday. In his surprise, he did not expect to see this in Clovis, New Mexico. I was a little bit taken in the back, but you know, I, I kind of was like, well, I will go with it. Mason has two decades of experience chasing storms. He says he and 400 other storm chasers crowded the small town of Clovis to catch this storm. Mason says it was a storm as damaging as any he's seen in previous times. The fact that it got wrapped in rain so quickly, it, it just was a very, very dangerous situation. Officials say it could have been worse. Local agencies like police and fire roam local communities to assess damage, while the community plays their part to clean the destruction. It's fantastic to witness the community coming together uh, to start to clean up this debris. A sign Holwalt says is promising moving forward. City and county officials say they plan to get everything under control once damages have been reported. In Clovis, Julian Paras, KOAT, Action 7 News.